It's a call law enforcement responds to all too often. How many pills did he take? A drug overdose. With an officer using Narcan to save a life. Wake up, brother. Now men and women behind the badge in Mojave County are leaving behind Narcan, along with a brochure on how to use it in a community gripped by opioids. Anytime someone is in crisis or an officer executes a search warrant, they'll leave a box and a pamphlet. Most of our search warrants involve methamphetamine and fentanyl now, and fentanyl, which is being sprinkled into everything. So as they clear a house, a search warrant, uh, it's a high-risk location. It gives them an opportunity to we, us to give them an opportunity to save a life potentially in the future. A pilot program developed by HIDA, or High Intensity Drug Trafficking Areas, that's working in the county four years ago was ranked first in the state for overdose deaths. Unfortunately, we were at the epicenter of the, the over prescribing of opioids. So people got hooked and then they turned to other drugs they could find on the streets? We began to see the effects of individuals turning to heroin and then uh, with the introduction of the fentanyl. But this new program has slashed overdoses by 49 percent last year compared to the year before. And just last month, none were recorded. Here's Haida director Don Mertz. Nobody wants a person to die of a drug overdose. So anytime we can help somebody not die of a drug overdose, I think we're doing a good thing. It's a program Haida wants to implement across the state in hopes of saving more lives. Just hang tight, right? In Phoenix. The medics are on the way. I'm David Coltbiano for Arizona's Family.